வெல்கம் பேக் டு ஐஆர் டிசன் எக்ஸ்போர்ட் சேனல் டு அனலிசிஸ் ஆஃப் பிசிக்கலி சேலஞ்சு ஸ்டேர் கேஸ் ஸோ ஃபுல்லி பேஸ்ட் ஆன் அனாலிசிஸ் ஆஃப் பிசிக்கலி சேலஞ்சு பீப்புள் ஸ்டேர் கேஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஆஃப் ஆல் கோயிங் டு செலக்ட் ஆட் கமாண்ட் ஃபார் சாலிட் ஒர்க் சிமுலேஷன் ஓகே சேடட் ஓகே ஃபைனலி ஆடட் சிமுலேஷன் ஷுட் பி கம்மிங் click and select the simulation first you have to select the start tick ok contact uh, set this is for uh, which of the components are contacted uh, in our assembly all the component you can select the inner and outer uh, connections it is what uh, all the entire components will be taken out to be analysis this is for exporter view this is fully based on uh, uh you can selecting for inner and outer surface i should select uh, contact set here we can select the uh, inner surface this is of the contact surface all the contact surfaces and uh, this is matting surface for uh, here hole okay okay again you can select the contact surface for this uh, con- con- so controlling rod of uh, staircase lever and then connected with uh, this apps this apps are mainly uh, controlled with the uh, oscillation motion of uh, staircase and then again you can select the contact surface select this uh, lever to this hole okay and again on time select this one to this one okay it is completed okay Okay, now I'm going to again, you can select the exporter view, automatic UCB merits, original position. Okay, now I'm going to select the uh, material. Apply the material, all the materials, you can select single material. You can select and uh, ally steel, apply. Apply the uh, ally steel material should be coming and then fixer. This will be make the uh, fixer geometry. You can fish fix at the bottom of the staircase outer body. Okay, we can fix. Okay, and then uh, give a load of uh, which direction to be give a load. This is for the staircase. We will give a uh, load of uh, generally the 150, 100, 100 is the maximum load, but we will give a staircase people should come with uh, the particular uh, uh, vehicle is also so we'll give uh, 300 okay then give a mesh okay this is mesh is completed okay this perfectly mesh in all the components now going to run the entire assembly it is completed now we will give a factor 50 should also include it so one is just to be selected okay we need to change the graph you can change the graph do so of uh, the right click and select uh, change sort option and the deformation and select and right click option of uh, deformation ok 
we will give a maximum and minimum um, uh, deformation for which position everything should be displayed if you click all the points you can click automatically this should be displayed and then stress value stress value is a maximum is 115 minimum is 0 now we can identify the maximum uh, load which person is maximum load which is a minimum load we will give a 100 of maximum and minimum but uh, the maximum load is constant but we will change the graph is also can reduce the uh, maximum minimum distance uh, automatically the variation of uh, the uh, color indication should be deferred based on the maximum graph uh, deviation So maximum minimum deviation should be changed automatically the uh, the color indication should be deferred and change the strain value 0 to uh, the maximum value 2.5 into the power of 4 Okay, strain value is a very minimum value, so we cannot change in maximum uh, deviation from the red color indication. The displacement is maximally rotating on on the second uh, staircase, the bottom portion to second uh, staircase the maximum deviation. The correct location, correct point is a maximum deviation should be indicated easily. The stress is also the first staircase nearby the first staircase you can change the maximum uh, uh, stress value 115 maximum uh, stress to be indicated. And then factor of safety, you can change the factor of safety value. Okay, this is maximum, very minimum factor of safety, you can change the factor of safety value. Okay. I am going to get a report of this entire analysis. It is very easy to get an entire analysis report and then uh, analysis image is also you can capture. This is uh, using to make uh, the maximum minimum value. We can easily identify the capturing of uh, maximum deflection value and uh, the capturing of image <coughs> is captured. And now we going to uh, take a capturing of image for stress value. Okay, and strain value. This uh, image is used to uh, create a report or otherwise a PPT. This kind of purpose we can use, and the uh, image is available in uh, which portion of our uh, model is say the same portion the image is available. Okay, here is available for the image. Okay, this is our model. 
okay this is a stress value okay these are the photos you can capture this also easy to capture the photos And get a report. This is a report you can generate it for all the click all the details, and then we can change the name of the report. And this is the location. This is the name of the report you can change. Okay. Is published. It takes some time for uh, publishing each and every step by step. Uh, image uh, the report should be generated uh, up to the starting stage. What are the work should be done? Everything should be displayed and comparative analysis and uh, what are the fixed uh, uh, degrees of freedom will give. And force. What are the force we will give? Which location we will give? And then uh, what are the material? Well, uh, we will give in uh, each and every component. Everything should be displayed on your uh, uh, report. And then miss uh, which which direction we will give a miss? Uh, how to be segregated for each and every uh, finite element to be available in all the components? It is also indicated.
okay the report is generated <coughs> this is the entire report for each and every step by step which position we can select and which of the solid body and what are the mass what are the volume density weight everything should be displayed on your report this is more useful for the students and to get uh, submit the report for the project Small kind of part that is more useful for this kind of reports. It's a load factor, and uh, which are the contact surfaces you can select. And then mesh size, mesh size of the each and every component. Everything should be displayed. And this is the results. So our stress value, the maximum minimum stress, and the deformation. The picture is very clearly identified. That uh, so it is more useful for the project, and then uh, strain value. Strain value is also indicated for maximum minimum value, and finally we got a factor of safety. Okay, this is a final model, and then added for a few more uh, images. Thank you for watching our design sports channel. Please subscribe my channel. Click the bell icon. Thank you.